Do you get stressed at the thought of trimming your dog's nails? You're not alone. In this video, we will discover five easy hacks for cutting your small dog's nails at home. So many dogs hate getting their nails trimmed. As a result, they fight and they bite to avoid it. But it is important to trim your pup's nails on a regular basis. If you have multiple dogs at home, you know that taking all of them to the groomer can be quite expensive. So many of us dog parents often have to learn how to cut our dog's nails right at home. Hack number five, paw touching. Before you cut your small dog's nails, practice touching and holding your dog's paw gently for a few seconds at a time, then give them a treat. This helps your dog stay calm when their paws are being touched. Do this a couple times per day to prepare them for their dog nail trimming. Hack number four, gather the tools you need ahead of time. You will need soft dog treats, nail trimmers, a bowl of cornstarch, paper towels, a helping hand, and a special treat. And let's not forget my new favorite lifesaver, the dog grooming hammock. You know those special tools that help professional groomers keep your pups still when they're getting their nails trimmed? Well now, dog parents like you and me can have this luxury at home. My three dogs, Echo, Bastion, and Greta, did awesome in this dog grooming hammock. I purchased the medium-sized dog hammock. They all fit just fine despite the different sizes. No more wiggling and no more biting. It's wonderful. This hammock helps hold your small dog in place while you trim their nails. And yes, it really does work, and it actually cuts down on the nail trimming time as well. Never leave the room when your dog is in the hammock. Keep it safe. Throughout the nail clipping process, have your helper give your pup some small, easy to chew dog treats. Also talk to your dog. Try to keep them distracted with your voice and treats as much as possible to help them stay calm. Hack number two. If you accidentally cut your dog's nail too short, don't panic. Your dog will mirror your reaction with anxiety and stress and will cause your pup to hate the nail trimmings even more. Try to stay calm and concentrate on fixing the nail. To stop the nail bleeding, apply pressure to the nail with a thick paper towel or gauze to help slow down the bleeding. Then push your dog's paw with the bad nail into your bowl of cornstarch. You can also add a pinch of cornstarch to the nail manually to help pack it in. This process helps stop the dog nail from bleeding. Give your dog some extra love and treats afterwards. Nail trimming tip. If you don't think you cut your dog's nails short enough after the first clipping, don't go back and clip the nail a second time. This is a mistake that I made in the past and have learned from it. It will always cause a bleeder. Avoid retrimming the nail. Hack number one. When you're all done cutting all of your dog's nails, give them a special treat. Something like a little bit of scrambled eggs or a scoop of peanut butter. Make it special to keep it a positive experience. Nail trimming tip number two. If you notice that your current nail clippers are just too hard to use or your dog's nails bleed easy, try an alternative nail trimmer like the Dremel Dog Nail Grinder instead. That way you can take off a little at a time and watch closely to avoid a nail bleed. Many dog trainers and groomers recommend getting your dog's nails trimmed more often, like once per week, to help them get used to it. Uh, personally, I manually trim my dog's nails at home every two to three weeks. Tell us about your dog nail trimming experience. What works for you?